guys i am just getting back from the gym and i didn't want to include that in this video because that's not an everyday thing like literally the only reason i went was because elise was like okay let's go to the gym and i didn't want to be that unproductive girlfriend that was like no i'm not gonna go so i am heading home right now and then we'll continue the morning routine there I just got home and I'm so hungry so I'm gonna go get an acai bowl. Tropical Smoothie has these new acai bowls I've been wanting to try. I just don't think like I can clean and do all this without eating first. But I had to get home and get my camera so let's go. I love the lighting in my room in the morning but when I'm sleeping I don't like it. I'm in the car already. Hopefully they have like the yogurt one. You know what I'm talking about? It's not like the purple bowl. It's the... It is not the purple bowl. It's like the one with the yogurt. Hopefully. Let's see. It's early so let's see if they have it. We always need apple carplay. One thing about me is I love Nathaniel Cano. I love his music and then I just think he's so funny. Like his little clips that he be doing. Me cambiaron los lyrics, wait. I'm not a fake fan, I promise. Cut, let's start it over again. Not too much now because I will get copyrighted. And I also have a boyfriend and I love him so, 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 so much. Do y'all do that too? Like I'm in a relationship, I love my relationship, but I love singing songs like if I was her. We're here. You guys have the mixed berry Greek yogurt? We do. Oh, okay. Can I get two of those, please? All right, go ahead. Pull up the front window. Thank you. My truck with a smoothie is like driveway. It's so high. Like, I have to get out of my car. And I also parked really far, like, from the window. But still. Imagine I told the worker, hey, why is it so far? The girl's probably gonna be like, girl, I just work here. I work today, but I have the whole morning off. So I was like, this is perfect to do a morning routine. My mornings aren't always like this. Like, I don't always go to the gym. Should I lie? I always go to the gym. And, like, I'm always eating acai bowls in the morning. I went downstairs and then I got a spoon. This wouldn't be an acai bowl then. This would just be a fruit bowl or yogurt with fruit. I've tried acai bowls like the purple ones before and I don't like them. I don't know. I just think they're too, too heavy or I don't know. I remember I wanted to try one for the longest. It just made mine look not aesthetic at all. Should I have gotten a fork or a spoon? I gotta catch up with you guys. So tomorrow is May 1st. I don't know when I'm gonna post this. This month I really want to be more productive like real life though. Like I even have my journal and I've been journaling. Like I've been journaling about vlogging, like more tips I can do, how I can like just make content better, how I can edit a little bit better. I've just been studying. When I say studying, I've just been watching people that I like to watch and then I just think like what do I see in them that I like. I like watching her videos because she just talks or the other one is I like to see her videos because her videos are like more aesthetic. I even did like a habits portion and then i just put every single day of may and then like if i do that part of the habit that i want to start doing i'll just highlight it hopefully by the end of may all of them are highlighted and then also for graduation like i still haven't got my graduation dress i'm going on a trip soon i need to start buying luggage start buying luggage storage then i'm gonna get closer to you guys so i'm gonna start making a schedule of how many times i'm gonna post a week because right now i post super random and i feel like if i had a schedule maybe people would watch a little bit more I'm just gonna quickly clean up my room a little bit. Usually I just leave my computer in this little cubby. I'll just leave my headphones on top of it. I'm gonna leave this up here. Yesterday the kids were playing outside. I don't know how they broke my back windshield wiper. I always keep these little gray wipes in my room. So this is like what I use to like wipe things down in my room only. And I'm gonna go put this over there in the cubby. Como se supone que voy. I'm gonna go ahead and get the things so I can shower. So this morning I didn't wash my face or anything. The only thing I did was brush my teeth. So I'm gonna rebrush them since I ate and then we're gonna wash my face. For face wash I'm using the Panoxyl. I like to make sure I rub it in real good in my forehead and right here on my cheek. All done. I have really bad hiccups.
Now it's time for skincare. I've been using it in the morning times because it's a brightening. It's not really a toner, but it's like a brightening treatment. That means I need to get a new one. Literally, it's just enough for my T-zone. I really like these as a primer and as like skincare because I used to use this as a primer and it would set really nice on it. I've been trying out the Radiant Sea Cream by Laneige. That's another like brightening treatment. These two pair really well together. I've been using the Laneige brand a lot lately. I'm super glad I got the big bottle of the moisturizer because I've been using lots of it. I love when my face feels smooth and it doesn't feel like dry or anything. I got this sun bum a while ago. When I used to go running, I would wear it a lot and then I liked it, I finished it and then I bought another one. But I haven't gotten to use this one and the skin is getting better. I feel like I had a really big pink bow down here. It's not there anymore. Look at the forehead. The forehead is so much better. I promise you guys I would not use no skincare. I would use face masks like very rarely. And now I'm loving the results. I love how my face is looking lately. And it's not like if I didn't have skincare products because I did, I would literally buy them. And then I just would never get to using them. Daily Koopa update, let me go get them. Ya llegó el puerquito. A ver, Cuba, come here. He needs a bath, you guys. I'm gonna take him a bath tomorrow. Now it's time to lotion me up. Why did I just notice that I'm supposed to be wiping this off? I can use it to shave on dry skin, but I have to wipe it off. But you guys, that's what literally keeps in all the moisture. I feel like I'm gonna keep using it how I've been using it. I feel like with lotion, you do keep the moisture in. But with this oil, I'm gonna do a little bit of school work. But I do need to straighten my hair, you guys. I have work later on, and I just don't want to mess with my hair curly. When I have curly hair, it's just a little bit more harder. Not harder, like just a little bit more difficult. Like more creams, more oils. So let's do a little bit of homework, and then we'll get to the hair. You guys, I say homework, but I mean school. I was I was watching this last night. time for my hair it's air dry just a little bit but i need to dry it so i can straighten it i got this dryer at tj maxx and it literally was only like 25 dollars or 23 i'm not sure but it's really really nice and i really like it low key looks like the dyson a little bit huh just a little bit i'm gonna be using this heat protectant i like to put a lot you guys because honestly i use a lot of heat in my hair where's my hairbrush where did i leave it I do sections and while I'm drying, I like to brush it. When I straighten it, it's a little bit more tame. Now that this half is dry, I'm gonna move to this half. One thing I do miss about not having extension, how easy it was for me to like shower and dry my hair and straighten it. Like literally, I remember it would just take me like an hour to just dry and straighten my hair. Now I feel like it takes me like an hour and a half or sometimes two hours. Once I get to the top, I use the cool setting. My goodness I literally look so crazy this is how my hair is looking it's completely dry now I'm gonna use this oil it's the Garnier fruit since I already put a lot of heat protectant I just want to put just something else I have an appointment next week for my hair but I've been contemplating to like take out my extensions and like let my hair rest for like four days I feel like I'm just not used to seeing myself with no extensions you guys I think it's time for a new straightener I use this one I don't know if I've told you guys in a video before literally I've had this straightener for years I'm already halfway done straightening it so I straightened it and then I'm just curling the end like this i wish i had a dyson because i see the girls on tiktok that have dyson they're literally straighten their hair with the dyson like there's a little brush that they do like, and it dries and straightens your hair at the same time you guys you know what i used to use i used to use this this is an artifact now like i could never use it again super good it was super good but i can't do that that will literally rip out an extension or like five at the same time now I'm gonna get ready. I'm just gonna do my everyday makeup. For my primer, I'm gonna use this NYX Do Me Up. I'm literally running out. I was gonna film for TikTok, but I don't think I'm gonna have time. You guys, I haven't picked up these big girls in a while. The Born This Way, they're the real heavy, like, you know, concealers. Super full coverage. I'm gonna use the Rare Beauty Blush. I love this blush. It's super cute. 
For my eyebrows, I'm gonna use the NYX, the brow glue, the tinted one in the brown. This is my favorite because you guys are gonna see the difference. So you see how it's just a little bit darker and a little bit more shape. This one's not. Now I'm gonna do my lashes. What mascara do you guys use? I love this telescopic one. It's my favorite. This is how my hair turned out and my makeup. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys next time. Bye.